Hello, 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 and welcome to Bad Mouse Gaming. I'm your host, Dave, aka Bad Mouse, and we are back in Raft. Uh, I know I said I was going to paint. I just haven't gotten there yet. Left my water thing open. You believe just right when I shut the water thing is when I started dying of thirst. But yes, my paints are done. I have white and red, I believe. Um, I just haven't made the brush or anything yet, so we haven't started painting. Plus, I think I'm going to need a lot more jars than that. But anyhow, so we are ready to start heading towards Tangora. Uh, 2597. Plug that in. Let's see here. Two, five, nine, seven. So it's behind us. All right, so before we get started with this awesome, awesome video, let me remind everybody, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please click that subscribe button down there. I like to try to at least get one on this video. And be sure to leave a comment. I enjoyed the comments. And of course, if this is something you like, click that like button. And with all that said and done, let's jump into this and let's get over to Tangora. Alright folks, I can start to see the outline of it. Even when you look straight at it, you can see it now. We are getting so close. Oh, we are viewing off. Oh, get back over here. Get back over here. Now we are back on course. I don't know what happened there. I guess we don't need you anymore. Alright, we're going to get up close, get docked, go to bed, and we're going to start this mission. Once we unlock the other doors, we can move our boat. But the idea is to get to the top of this tower and blow the top off. But this is going to be tricky, but if you want banana seeds, this is where you get them. And once you pick them all, they will respawn each time. All you got to do is leave the island and, um... <laughs> Pushed you off. Whoa, what happened? I saw it coming, but I was kind of talking and I didn't react fast enough. So we don't need our swimming gear. The engines are still on. Oh, there we go. I'll remove this. There we go. I feel better now. I'm ready. Yep, I'm buffed. Oh shoot, the shark is in here. Probably should have emptied out my inventory. If you want, we got cockroaches in here. I'm gonna take mine off so I don't waste my battery. Should we just go to bed first? Yeah, folks, we're just gonna go to bed first. Get that out of the way. Oh man, I kind of remember this now. Do you remember it? 
You have to move these boxes around to where one of us can walk through all the way. And then this ends up on the water if I remember right. I know, but we're gonna need that space. My helmet died while we was doing that. All right, we should be able to at least get to the secret. There it is. That gave us a little bit of something. Titanium ore, look at that. There's a machete. There's a lot of titanium in here. Oh, there's so much titanium in here. Now, technically, once you pick that box up, that should be it. Just leave it in the air and we'll just walk under it. Yeah, that, no, th yeah, that one. Once you pick it up, can we just leave it there? Try picking it back and up and see if we can just leave it there if we was just walk under it. Somebody drop something. Of course it was. Yeah, but there's no walking under that. The engines are dumb. People upstairs are already upset about the extreme rationing. Now we're at the mercy of the waves. And those rafts on the horizon are coming closer by the hour. I'm sealing up the reactor now. I really could have used you here, Hunter. Well, it looks like we made it to the surface. Oh no! I let all the water in. Wait a minute, there's another door. Cow opened the wrong door there, didn't I? Which way are you going? <laughs> I'm in the generator room. I ain't know where to go for air. We're back. We're back in that. fire on the rafters a damn riot broke out some supported Tully's orders others really did not a smaller raft made its way into the water entrance but there was only a kid on board his parents were sick I think poor boy isn't saying much Tangaroa's a lost cause we're getting out of here a lot of mutiny going on this one here plantation Yeah. <gasps> ah. Now if I remember each room had a switch we had to fix. Oh, we need the duct tape to fix the switches. Grab the note and the duct tape. Oh, no, 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 no! The 
entire ecosystem is ruined. Uh, I've warned the Captain Tully about this for weeks now. My contract doesn't allow me to tell anyone else, and it's eating me up inside. The banana plants won't bear nearly enough food, not to mention the infestations. We'll be starving by the end of the year, if not uh. sooner. My game keeps screwing up and I keep sliding right off. Keep going. I've got two rolls of duct tape already. Yeah. Holy cow. So yeah, we're going to have to go all the way up. Surface access. Oh, here's another note. Things have gone quiet. Security team still going patrols in their ridiculous golf carts trying to keep some semblance of order. I heard the rafters let loose some type of a rat. Oh, and they strapped tasers on all the butler bots. Like some kind of dumb guerrilla war upstairs. We're fixing up a boat, but there's no engine. The raft kid thinks we could take one of the golf cart engines. It's not a bad idea. Captain Tully and the investors are still up in the tower. I say leave them there to rot. Huh. These, these guys are getting more and more desperate. Alright, we gotta keep an eye out for those Tazzy taser equipped robots. Yeah, I got one here too. There we go. We get a key card every time we kill one. Ah. Alright, I guess we can take our headlights off. Um, let's, um, put down these exit ramps here and, uh, move the boat over so we can at least get access to the boat. Jeez, I don't even see the boat. I see arrows going off. That way, so we'll go that way and release the next one from there. Nope. Just gonna watch the neighborhood fireworks. That's not too bad. <laughs> yeah, we might as well keep the boat here. We can still have the good access. I mean, I know we can clip through the ramp here and actually have the ramp go through the boat. All right, we came back to go to bed because I hate doing this in the dark. So it's actually morning time. Sun's coming up. We're gonna, I guess we can probably split up and get as many duct tapes as we can. Pick up notes as we find them. Yeah, I know. We just need to get the duct tape so that we can finish up the below the electricity thing. Alright, so if you can find this statue, there is a note over here. The kid's name is Deto. How someone his age was able to reconstruct an engine like that? I'll never know. But now we've got the boat working. We'll be gathering up a few more survivors before we head off. The rafters either hid up in the apartments or left to sea. Most of them seemed sick. No wonder they were so desperate. We need to hurry. Those large rats that came with the rafters are aggressive. 
I say let them chew Tangaroa into pieces. I'm coming for you, Hama. Remember the place we heard about? The sanctuary? We'll meet there. I know it. I'll see you there. Utopia. Utopia. Alright, so, um... It looks like... If you look on these buildings, like, that's got number eight. And this is the cheeseburger place. So once we get to the top up there, we're going to need a four-digit code. And we have a map that says look at each one of these buildings. And each one of them numbers is part of the code. So we already know what the code is. So uh, when we get to that point, I'll explain it again. Right now, we're just after duct tape. We have to search all the floors for duct tape. Well, I hate when you cut vines down and there's nothing inside the room except for a stupid crate. I I think we have enough tape. He's still looking, but I'm going to start heading down now. And I'm going to see if I can't shut these electrical things off. Okay, enough. Yeah, I'm down here. I'm gonna do this. There's our first one. And what these do is they this open is up different doors. to go that way. Maybe not this way. This is the way we need to go. We got to go in there. That fixes that one. And we got one more here. Let's go check out this room. Well, there was a tape in that room. I don't know if we fixed this one yet or not. Yeah, we already fixed that one. down this way oh we just did that one
there one in this room? Where is it? Ain't nothing in this room. You done with all those down there? I'm missing one somewhere. Oh, I know exactly which one you're talking about. It took me a while to find it, too. Yeah. I got nothing to do. Let me come down and help you. Getting nighttime already. All right, I think I found it here. Yep. There, I got it. Now we can do the elevator. I'm already down here, so I'll go. Well, to go through here to the elevator. Alright, we have a secret floor here. Back down to the secret room. We push that little button there instead of over there and we have a secret floor. Okay, save. Set tape to play oh, your tape deck. Thing. Let me know how much total titanium you pick up. I didn't pick up any. You ain't picked up none of the crates. Yeah, dude, I picked up a briefcase or something, a safe. There's, there's two safes and a briefcase still. Still no titanium. The safes are on top. There's one titanium. There's two titanium. I think it's random. Alright, I guess we're done down here. Well. Drop a zero real quick. No. That should be just ground floor. Yeah, I know, but I want to go open up the door real quick. Oh, we'll have to go back down, I think. No, I pushed it. There's a bunch of money in this box. Oh. And then we're looking for a broken window. There ain't nothing on this floor. Yeah. Did it let out on the ground level? Where's the damn stairs? Over here. Yeah, there's a bunch of coins on the table back there inside one of the boxes. Yeah. There's a couple of coins there on that table too. Now this is it. Now we just gotta make our way up here. That's supposed to heal me, right? Yeah. Go up to the next floor. Use my two healing salves. Don't wanna die again. <laughs> I think it's just pretty much coins on, uh... Yeah, I skipped the... all the middle floors. I went straight to the top. Alright. 
I'll do the middle floors and pick up coin. Huh. We are over here. There's a briefcase. So the top of this, we're going to blow off and it's going to land in the water. As soon as he gets over here. And there's a doorway in. Now, on the ground floor here, there's blueprints. Hold on, hold on. Don't close it yet. I think they're... Is it here? Yeah. yeah, on the ground floor, I think there were blueprints. All right, we'll hit them up on the way down. We'll do that first. Uh, we'll hit it up on the way down, so we'll use the elevator to get down. Okay. All right, right. Here, here's some blueprints. So if you guys remember, each one of them buildings had a um, door code on it. Note. This is what we're looking for right here. This is telling you to look for the barbershop, the uh, Tranquil Street. Oh, we missed a note, huh? Something there. It shows you the streets, and then it oh, gives I think you that a clue. Might be on the ground floor. What note? The one that you're missing. We were missing one. Oh, yeah. But we're going to look. We already know what the numbers are. We need to look ahead of time. All right. So what's that code? Oh, you already put it in? Oh, you want me to? But didn't you? The door's open. No, I opened the door. You ready? Yeah. Here it goes. I think it's over here, though. All right, now we go back down and move our boat over and we can get our next destination code. You didn't pick up these blueprints right here. Large storage. So we are done with the bubble city. All we got to do is go over here, grab our digits for our satellite thing here. There is someone in here we're going to talk to. A new character that we can switch into. And then, uh, yeah, we'll be on to our next destination. There she is. Oh, you there! Get me out of this thing! Oh. Next time, I would appreciate a heads up before launching. I tried to leave when the first shots were fired. Tangaroa was doomed from the start. If you get me a ride out of here, I can offer you entrepreneurial consulting. Plus, Ooh. I did some sailing in my youth. Won a few championships. I'll be useful. Okay. Wonderful. You can count on me. My name is James Tully. This is my final message. Tangaroa City was built on a purely theoretical basis, using engines that had barely been tested, held together by the sweat and tears of our crew. But we were never sustainable. I should have accepted that months ago. When the rafters arrived, I could have let them starve with us. But I didn't. The only right choice was to abandon Tangaroa to the waves. Now I will stay here, trapped in the cockpit, with two dozen idiots who used to run the world. Don't worry. We'll pay for our sins before the end. Huh. 
Um, where's the last note at? Right here? Yeah. Right here. There's the water tank. It's the water purifier that you missed. Yeah, we'll go find it. Hi, everybody. It looks like we have our next destination, Verona Point. We're going to go back in, find the water purifier um, blueprint, and then we'll go ahead on out. So I think this is where we're going to leave this episode. Make sure you guys leave a comment down below. Click them like buttons, and um, we'll see you guys next turn. Thanks for watching.